you know, I thought today was a good first day. Um, you, know, I, you know, one of the things you come out in the first practice, you know, especially, you know, the, within the last few years, some of the rule changes that allow, you know, you to go on air in the summer, you know, you know, the, the, the rhythm, the timing, um, you know, we haven't been able to, to, you know, work with guys when they've went against each other. But, you know, a lot of the things just operationally, that's what I was looking for. I want to see communication. I want to see alignment. I want to see, you know, guys uh, being able to, to work to execute with tempo um, within, uh, you know, you know, obviously uh, offensive and defensive schemes and be able to take some of the, uh, the lessons that we, that we have uh, you know, taught throughout the course of summer, see them applied today. And I did, I, I, felt, I felt like we had good speed. Um, I thought the guys you know, moved around with confidence for a first day. Um, you know, obviously some young guys you know, still working to, uh, to figure some things out just here at the very beginning of it, that can be expected. Um, you know, it's a, you know, obviously, like I said, it's the first time you know, with, the, with the competitive um, you know, guys having somebody lined up a, across from them. Um, that we've been able to be out there and coach some of those fundamentals. So a lot of good film. Uh, you know, I thought the guys you know had, to, had the right approach. Uh, you know, good meetings. Uh, you know, yesterday. You know, starting it off, and then uh, you know, obviously jumping into today. I thought it was a, a good start to uh, to our fall camp. So, uh, you know, pleased with what I saw. A guy like Ben Trout, second year in the system here. How is it different for them? Obviously, skills don't change, but are you feeling like you can follow that? Yeah, you know, I mean, just the, the, the confidence, understanding. You know, really, uh, you know. It, you're taking an, a, a next level approach to the to the finest of the details, and you know you say this, you know skills you know have changed. They've they've gotten better, and that's something that um, you know our guys you know they work really hard in the off season, and you know for everybody that has played, you know guys that have been out there, guys that have been contributor uh, contributors. I mean that's the push is that they have to be better, and you know you know obviously when you know and you're very confident in what you're being asked to do, um, you know it's going to allow you to play faster. And so I think that also you know, helps ex accelerate. I thought he looked, you know, did some good things today, um, you know. Uh, but you know, that can be expected from a guy that's played as much ball as he has, and you know just has a work ethic that he brings. The combination of him and Daria is it something like you guys are trying to figure out? No, I mean, it, yeah, no, I mean it's 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 really big. And you know, we, and you know, you look at that. You know, last year, I mean, it's something that we've been accustomed to. You know, we've had you know had some great players at uh, at corner. Um, you know, and those guys have been, you know, key contributors into that. And, you know, maybe uh, the, the, the role of, of Azaria has definitely, um, you know, increased. You know, his, you know, his uh, you know, talent and ability is definitely uh, continuing to develop. And, uh, you know, really excited about him. And I'm really excited about the guys that are pushing in behind him. I mean, you know, you look at, you know, I mean, I thought there were a lot of guys that, that made good plays today, uh, you know, in that, in that secondary. So just not to, but like, you know, Quinn showed up, uh, you know, which, I, which, you know, we were expecting him to take a big step. Um, you know, but uh, you know, I thought it was very competitive. You know, some of the young corners that you know, you know, you got Kai and Charles that were here, uh, you know, in the spring, and you know, you know, say you know they were just learning, and uh, you know, a lot of things technique-wise, but they they played faster today, and they were they were I thought they did a good job. So, um, you know, I think that corner room, you know, is 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 you know a really good room, and it's one that I'm excited to see uh, uh, you know those guys continue to compete and, and emerge. Did you like what you saw? Yeah, you know, I mean, I, I think you know, different times of you know just progression reads you know, what you know what you're trusting and how you see it. Um, I thought you know I really thought both the quarterbacks, uh, you know, all the quarter. I mean, you know, the young guys still, um, you know, with Luke and um, you know Trevor. I mean, they're they're gonna it's gonna be the, the process of, of continued growth, especially on early days. Uh, but I thought you know the reads, you know, the looks, um, you know, sometimes going just going through a progression. I thought both guys did a nice job. Uh, you know, taking them, you know, taking the the opportunities in the middle of the field are big. Uh, because you know, obviously, there's usually more bodies in there, and it's you got to be you know very certain in what you see, um, and, and and the timing of it is so critical. So I think it does show a, a, a progression and a step of just the confidence in, in, in eyes and you know being able to locate the ball. Elijah Moore, someone that's already kind of starting to look the part at the beginning of the summer. How did you get to practice tonight? Oh, I thought it was good. I mean, I thought he was able to make a couple plays. I mean, you know, a lot of things that you know, you know he's going to get to figure out. And uh, but you know the the. The size, speed, playmaking ability—all things that you know—we were very confident that we were uh, that we were getting. But it was good to see him go out there and make some some plays in his first day. And um, you know, I've said a lot to, to learn and grow from. Cam Rogers played in multiple defensive systems over his career. So, do you know what you expect him to be for this team, and how do you kind of figure that out over the next month? Yeah, you know, we're excited about Cam and what he brings to the program. Uh, you know, experience, you know, maturity. Um, you know, he's just a great you know person in the locker room. Um, you know, it's it's really been. 
been nice to see, you know, just throughout the course of the summer, the relationships that he's built, the work that he's putting, he's very smart. So, you know, you take the, um, the, the, you know, the past experiences on the field that he's had, and then now you got to learn a, a language and you get to, to learn adjustments and you get to make sure that the communication with the guys uh, that you're out there with, uh, you know, that you're as efficient and, and uh, uh, you're clear as you can be on that. So that's going to be the biggest part for him. Um, you know, I I'll, I'll, I'll like, you know, his athleticism. Obviously, you can see him and he's, he's a huge human being and uh, you can definitely run. So um, you know, we're, we're, we're excited about what he brings and, you know, we'll see where, uh, you, know, you know, just how, how well that uh, you know, all meshes together here in these next couple weeks. Yeah, I mean, we'll see today. I mean, you know, we'll see where that is. But like, you know, these first couple of days when you're just you know, in helmets, I mean, it's hard to, to tell anything from, you know, offensive line part of it. It's just, do, does he, do you have an understanding of which way you're going? And then obviously the footwork to execute, to be able to achieve that. But still a lot of uh, other elements that are, you know, I said not real, not real football in a sense. But I mean, he's, uh, you know, he's very smart. You know, he's, he studies, he, he's got good feet. Uh, you know, I'm excited about what he brings. You know, he brings great versatility. Uh, you know, he's a guy that we are going to start off early here, just really pushing a lot of uh, you know center reps uh, to to be able to build that with within his skill set. But I mean, definitely going to compete at guard uh, for us, and a guy that uh, you know I think has you know a great upside. So um, I'm looking forward to, to how he's going to going to do as as we you know go through camp, get pads on, and you know get more in those uh, situations. But uh, you know, I love everything I've seen so far. Yeah, you, know, you know, I mean, really, when you look at uh, when you look at you know Rob and uh, um, you know Darius, I mean, those guys have played so much football, and and really, you know, you know JB as well. I mean, yeah, yes, we have great competition there, but you got I think three guys that are over two thousand snaps in their career, so it's it's really uh, making sure that you know Rob had a great summer, and he was you know from his movements, all he was doing. Um, but we're gonna, you know, we're gonna have a plan to make sure those guys get the work that's necessary, um, but also you know, being smart with them too. And uh, you know, but I, I'm definitely excited to see how that competition is gonna play out because, you know, there's three three talented guys, and uh, you know, and obviously it helps, you know, those we you know, for Lucas for Jalen Early. Uh, I mean, they need every rep that they can get as well. You know, pushing themselves, and you know, I think that's gonna be big for their continued development. Is that good? All right. Thank you, thank you, coach. Thank you. Thank you, coach.